Now, I really hope that you are enjoying these manifesting March vlogs. Um, I'm realizing that every single manifestation is owed equal um, respect, gratitude and appreciation, no matter how small or how big the amount I'm managed to, managing to manifest. And just like Frugal February, I am learning so much. So I'm actually going to be doing a video um, where I summarize all the key things that I've learned from doing Manifesting March, but also share with you how much I've actually manifested. So if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe because when I see my subscribers going up and your comments and feedback, I know I'm on the right path and I'm delivering content that I know um, you're enjoying and actually is helping you back. The other night I did an online survey and I earned a $25 voucher which I'm gonna redeem at Coles. Now, some people will say, why would you bother waste, you know, for $25, who cares? But I have to buy groceries anyway, so I'm gonna use this voucher and then I will transfer $25 into the $1,000 project account. I am making every dollar count. So the business proposals that I've sent out during the month of March, um, they're still in conversation. And I don't wanna just sit around waiting. I'm using this time productively to send out other proposals and other ideas that I've got um, going. So don't just sit around waiting, wasting time, like move on to the next whilst, you know, because things do take a while to actually happen. Marco, what are you doing? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> this morning I made a quick trip to the bank. Um, I had those parcels of cash in my wallet from like saving uh, money from my weekly and weekend budget. It wasn't a huge amount of money, but it definitely added up. And I was a little bit worried with it being in my wallet. I was worried I'd, I'd just spend it. So to clear my concerns, I just went and deposited it into um, the $1,000 project account. And I have to say, it was really satisfying seeing the account balance go up by $100. And also it made me feel a lot more secure because I had removed temptation from my wallet. So my wallet, the remaining money in my wallet is for the rest of the week and for the upcoming weekend. So if my advice to you is if you're doing the thousand dollar project or doing manifesting March and trying to save money, get that cash out of your wallet so that you don't get tempted to spend it. All right, I always, I always say all right, I don't know why. So I blog post with that, sorry about that. So I just had a sugar mama consultation and we were talking about money blocks and this person was talking about her money blocks and I was helping her break them down. As she was explaining them to me, we were working through them, identifying them and um, I was giving her the actions to get rid of them and understand them. Something resonated within me and one of those money blocks, like this feeling went off inside me and it was like an inner electric shock and I realized one of her money blocks was actually one of my own money blocks and it's around the limit or ceiling of earning money you know that I can only earn a certain amount or I'm only capable of earning a certain amount and this is something I've carried for a while and I've been trying to break for a while anyway to cut a long story short we worked through her money blocks and I could see like the layers coming back and the weight coming off her shoulder and the awareness that she was creating within herself which was fantastic but then also the same thing was happening for me and she actually gave me some fantastic business feedback and business ideas to break my own money blocks. And one of the things she talked about was allowing people to engage with me on a more personal level and creating like a membership area through Sugar Mama and through the thousand dollar project. So if you like the sound of this, like let me know by putting a comment in the comments box below because this is something I really want to explore. It will enable me to actually spend more time you know, building a personal relationship with you, um, not just through the YouTube community. So I would love to know what you think about uh, having a membership to Sugar Mama TV where you can engage me on a regular basis. Let me know. Last week I got a hat experience, a bit of a financial um, improvement. To cut a long story short, I agreed to help someone out a long time ago and agreed to help them out by doing something at a huge discount for them just to help get them back as back on their feet anyway almost a year had gone by and that discount was still applying and they thought it was kind of fair and you know they obviously they were getting the better end of the deal but the thing for me was i was starting to feel like things weren't fair but i'm not someone who um and i kind of actually felt like i was being taken advantage of you know a year later 
Anyway, I'm not someone who likes confrontation. Um, I get quite anxious around it and it's a bit of a hard one for me. But anyway, during Manifesting March, I kind of slowly built up my sense of self-worth and, um, you know, thought about the logistics, the, the financials, the mathematics, the whole, um, I guess, energy of the situation and stood up for myself and put my foot down and said, look, happy to have helped you. It's not been a problem, but enough's enough. It's been a year now and things need to be fair and equal um, if, you, if you want the situation to keep going. Anyway, fortunately, the person recognized it and everything was amicably settled and sorted and all fine. And it, but that is, it's funny that it happened in March because it's been something that's been bugging me for a really long time. But I've only now actually had the strength to actually make it happen. So I guess if you're in a situation where you've been wanting to ask for a pay rise for a long time or someone's owed you some money or, you know, something's not been right or fair in your financial situation, Maybe the month of manifesting March is the time to stand up for yourself.